So what exactly happened? How could an entire panel of an aircraft just rip off like this? To get some clues, let's first see what the hell a door plug even is. Door plugs are essentially structural and cosmetic covers for empty door frames. They are options for the 737-9 plane when an airline is purchasing the aircraft. If the customer wants a higher maximum occupancy, they can take the option to have a functional door installed in this door frame. This is because the number of passengers allowed in an aircraft is linked to how many emergency exits there are. If they chose for a lower occupancy, they can opt for a door plug, as Alaska Airways did. The door plug is not a functional door. It, as the name would suggest, simply plugs the doorway with a door-shaped plug. You can tell them apart from the outside, as they have full-sized windows, where actual doors have smaller windows. On the inside of the plane, you can't tell that the door frame is there, as the panels look the same as any other panel. This allows a standard row of seats to be installed in this location. Deactivating this exit reduces the max occupancy of the 737-9 from 230 people to 189. If an airline later decides to increase the occupancy and operate more like a budget airline, like say Ryanair, where seats are placed closer together, they can later install a fully functional door in this location. 